Hello everyone, welcome to Violet Adazé. Violet here, and today I am looking at Duda Beats featuring Trevor Nam Um Puquinho. Nem um pouquinho. Nam Um Pouquinho. Nem um pouquinho. Nam Um Pouquinho. And it translates to not even a bit. Not even a bit of what. We gonna find out today. Shout out to these people that told me to look at this video. Before we get started, I have a quick shout out to give to Life's Greatest Lessons TV. They're a channel based in the Philippines and they do inspirational and motivational videos. Subscribe to their channel for new videos every Monday and Thursday. The link to their channel and their latest video will be in my description box below. With that being said, let's get into this. Ooh, I love how the camera came in clutch. That zoom in was stupendous. Is this Flash? We got a whole superhero in a whole music video? Run for your life, he on fire. I am loving the whole style of this so far. It's almost post-apocalyptic or like cyberpunk vibes. Cyberpunk vibes. I live for cyberpunk vibes nowadays, so mm, it's giving me what I need. So creepy! That was sick though, that was really creepy. Wait! <laughs> what is going on in this video? We got some vampires. We got a player. He was at the beginning of the video with another girl. He ran all the way to the other side of town to meet another girl just to bite her neck. We got this woman with her scary looking eyes and her bitten neck looking like she's about to eat your kids. What is going on? What in the Blade Trinity is going on here? Whoa! Did you see how she blinked? She blinked like a reptile. She blinked like an alligator, crocodile, reptile. Why is she being such a creeper? She's always coming around corners. She looks so creepy, guys. It's so unsettling to look at her eyes. It's, it's so creepy. What is going on? This is sick. No, this is... No, we are gonna give this guy his props. Look at this move. That looked like he did it in slow motion, but he didn't do it in slow motion. Just based on the one minute of music video I've seen so far, this concept, whatever it is, can be made into a whole feature film and I will watch. So she... She disguised herself as a guy and then she came to look at her ex-boyfriend. He's her. She's him. Okay, guys, I'm getting hyped. First of all, the song, I love the song. I love the different vibe. It's a different sound from what I'm used to hearing. The movement, the eyes, the set pieces, the weirdness of it all is just very, very, very tantalizing. <laughs> She came back again. She's all these people. She scratched his face and now he has to get stitched up. So I'm thinking that was her ex-boyfriend. Maybe he's the one that turned her into whatever she is. And she's pissed now. And he's going around living his own life. Freaking biting other women and she's pissed. And she wants her revenge. I'm gonna go with that. Oh, this is so sick in a good way TikTok must have sponsored this video because they're showing TikTok logos all over the place guys come on you cannot tell me this is not the best the cinematography is lit the editing never mind I can see why you guys told me to look at this video because this is sick and I like how the music changed for a minute there. Oh, she's changing to a new alter ego. I love how the music just switched vibes. That's sick. I love when music does that. Yes, Papa Wheelie. Okay, E.T. E.T. That's, that's the inspiration, I think. 
This is so sick. I can see them still in like the silhouettes in the moon. This guy is just going around town, making out with everybody. This scene right here gives me the same vibe as King's Dead by Kendrick Lamar. <gasps> Ooh! This. This gives me Rain On Me by Lady Gaga vibes. I don't know if they did that on purpose, probably not, but I just love how it reminds me of so many pop culture moments. Oh, I love it. They're like, are you okay? <laughs> She's like in a sunken place. She's like, get out in a sunken place where she's in a different person's body. This guy is scared for his life. Oh, shit! What just happened? <laughs> that was some demonic shit right there. <laughs> oh. She is so creepy. In the best way. That is a sick outfit like the concept of it is sick what is it possible for one music video and song to make you an official fan that was literally one of the most impressive first time viewings of a new artist i've seen is she big in brazil and if she's not how is she not because she is sick like that concept if all her music videos are like that oh i'm about to be a whole fan <laughs> Let me check out the lyrics before I say any more. What? I know that you ain't worth not even a little bit, but still, I want to give you my affection. To be able to finally satisfy our solitude without getting involved is already a bit complicated. I'm yet to meet someone who buys this idea. Or was it just me? Or was it just me? Who thought wrong? And then this is the chorus. We used to dance together. We used to eat together. We used to talk about everything. It was everything together. When I realized I was a joke, you laughed and I cried. You only snubbed me and it came to nothing. I was trying to sing it in the tone that the chorus went. I think I feel miserably, but A for effort. I want to see what people are saying. Woman, what is this production? He puts it all to shame. I'm in shock. Literally. It was so well done. I want to see a feature film based on that music video. That's how well done it was. This hair needs to be many millions. It's everything pop fans have come to expect from international productions. As we have this muse here carrying three different styles in one song and delivering an award worthy clip. Let's stream. This person encompassed everything I feel and more. Oh, this is from the actual artist, Duda B. And she said, this clip is pure adrenaline. What scene most impressed you? Oh, I have a few that just comes to mind. The first scene that most impressed me, first of all, is the quick zoom up in the uh, very first scene that was sick. I loved when the camera peeked around the corner and she peeks around the corner and she looks so creepy. Oh, I love when she first switched to being a different person. The bald guy, when he hopped over the table, that was sick. Oh, when she was like floated above the ground in the middle of the street, that was sick. When they were in that one fight room and they were holding each other and like it was frozen and then she like scratched him, that was sick. There's too many sick moments to count. But it's hard to pick one scene that was my the most impressive. Everything. With that being said, guys, that was me looking at Do The Beat featuring Trevor. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up. Comment down below your thoughts on this video. I need to just know if you guys are on the same wavelength as I am right now, because I'm so shook. And if you aren't subscribed, consider subscribing to my channel and clicking that notification bell. I do videos for Anita, for Pablo Vitar, for Gloria Groove, for Ludmilla, for Isa, for Do The Beat now. So stick around, we'll have fun, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.